President Trump has promised to strip the Church of Scientology of its religious duty absolved status, in a move that will uncover the congregation for the clique it truly is. As per a HuffPo report, private Twitter messages from a Trump family companion and best authority at the Department of Housing and Urban Development uncovered that Trump couldn't concur more that the congregation ought to lose its assessment absolved status. Theheld.com reports. From the minute I saw your arrangement I revealed to President Trump and his family we expected to disavow their duty absolved status. They couldn't concur all the more, yet kindly don't plug that yet, Lynn Patton kept in touch with performing artist Leah Remini in the messages acquired by HuffPost. This will complete in the following four years or I'll kick the bucket attempting. Thump on wood. Patton is a long-lasting companion and business partner of the Trump family who has worked with the Trumps since 2009. A year ago, she talked in help of Trump at the Republican National Convention in June. Remini, who featured on the hit arrangement Ruler of Queens, is behind the Emmy Award-winning show Leah Remini, Scientology and the Aftermath. The show is a narrative inspecting the Church of Scientology, which Remini left in 2013 and its asserted manhandle of commentators. I anticipate doing my part to help put a conclusion to this continuous bad dream and glaring abuse of our IRS rules and controls, Patton kept in touch with Remini. I need to accomplish more research on Scientology's history with the IRS, to date, so I can better comprehend what strategies have been connected and where we can get. It is hazy if Patton at any point spoke with the IRS and a demand for input from the Huffington Post was not promptly replied. Specialists told the Huffington Post that such an encouraging from an organization authority would likely be illicit. For the White House or any organization authority to attempt and impact who the IRS focuses, for reasons unknown, isn't right and could bring about an infringement of the law, said Larry Noble, a previous general advice of the Federal Election Commission. The IRS must settle on these choices freely with no impact by the White House or organization authorities. The IRS site expresses that the IRS may start a congregation charge request just if a suitable abnormal state treasury official sensibly accepts, on the premise of certainties and conditions recorded in composing, that an association asserting to be a congregation or a tradition or relationship of places of worship may not meet all requirements for exception.